Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Gran Turismo 6. Today is episode number 4. If you guys do want to keep up to date with what is going on on the Mechanic CG channel, then make sure to go down in the description and check out all of our social links. We've got Discord, Twitter, and Instagram. Uh, and if you want to help support the channel, then make sure to hit that join button, that subscribe button, or that like button. And hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Right, so today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be starting off with the five minute races. Um, oh, these are actually like timed races, so that's good. Um, so we're going to start off with Autumn Ring Mini, then go to Sukuba, which is a really nice track. And then the Circuit of Rome. So let's start off with uh, the Autumn Ring. We can take the Camaro SS, just about actually. Uh, 500 performance points maximum. Uh, let's enter and listen to some banging tunes. Five minute races, autumn ring, the mini one. Look at that. It just looks like such a nice track. Uh, so we're going against a Clio, uh, Celica. I don't know what a uh, prelude is. But we'll probably find out. That looks very interesting. Okay. Right, let's get in and start straight away then. Let's go. This card definitely feels out of place. And for some reason, the traction controls turned itself back onto maximum, so I can't do slides around these corners. I'm very sad about that now. Imagine like your favorite like movie chase scene. This is what this is like. You've got some crappy car and then this overpowered Camaro going against everyone else. Awesome, come on, come on. Nice, nicely done. Got three minutes and 48 seconds left of the session. Whoa! Traction control couldn't save that drift. But we managed to get around the corner in style. Here we go. Perfect. Slowing down here. Shifting down to probably one too many gears too low, actually. Here we go. Nice. Oh, don't need to shift down there. Gone off the track as well. Here we go. Much better. The time has gone yellow at three minutes. Interesting. I wonder if we can do like timed races in. Um, well, I want to see timed races come back. Um, in Gran Turismo 7 when that comes out. Perfect. Look at that. Understeer. Nice. Awesome. Here we go, slow down for this corner. We're on lap number five now. Looking very good for time here. 
1 minute 36 left. Ooh, look at that drift. Speed is key. Nice. Managed to get a couple of drifts in there. Perfect. Coming up to lap number seven now. I have a feeling we're not going to get an extra lap in. Yeah, we're not going to get an extra lap in after this. The guy in front of me is not going to get an extra lap, and he's still on lap six. There you go. Bob's been knocked out. That's the end of the race for him. Yeah, he got stuck one lap behind Mr. Bob Hughes. Nice. Nicely done. Right, what is next? What is going to be our next race? Oh, 8,000 credits. That's a very nice paycheck. Thank you very much. Right. Um, next up, let's have a look. Gran Turismo. Right, so next up is the Sakuba circuit. So we're going to be taking the Camaro again. Hopefully we can get uh, a very good time with this car as well. Uh, get as many laps in as possible. Um, I think the Sakuba is about a minute, so I'm predicting we're going to get five laps in. In fact, we should easily get five laps in, but hopefully, if we set some good times, we could get six in. Um, we're going against a Sprinter, another Prelude, um, an RSX, and a Civic, and a Starlet. So... Interesting. Um, oh, traction control is lowered. Okay, never mind. Maybe I might uh, bump it down a bit more then. And let's start. Alright, here we go. Time for the Camaro to shine. Got past the prelude there. We got another British person in this race. Nice. Perfect. Here we go. That lowered traction control has given us a lot of uh, help there. Squeeze through. Can we squeeze through? Yes, that was a very toxic corner, but I don't care. You can see when the car understeers because uh, it sort of hops a little bit at the front. Which is sort of an interesting representation of how cars understeer. 
Nice. Perfect. Looking very good here. Oh. Went off, off the road a little bit there. Come on. Perfect. Nice. Perfect. I love these hairpin corners. They are really good to drive around. Here we go. Perfect. Nice. Hold up. There we go. Nice. Perfect. I have a feeling we're only going to get five laps in. I don't think we'll get that sixth. Um, it would be good to get that sixth lap in, but I just don't see it happening. Nice. Yeah, we can't get a 38 second lap with one minute and four seconds. Perfect. Right, coming up to this corner here. Really good break in there. Only one braking zone that we did there. And this is the final lap. So Edward, I'm guessing that's his name. <laughs> in last place, didn't get a post the fifth lap. We did get the fastest lap though on our final lap, so that is decent. We've got Civic, Starlet, yeah, that's a very good time. On to the next one then. First place. And three stars. Awesome. Right, on to uh, Rome next, I think. I think it was Rome. I hope it's Rome, because I've just said it multiple times. It is Rome. Good. Right, let's do this. Five minutes on the clock. Let's see what cars we're going up against in the Circuito di Roma. Uh, by the looks of it, we're going against a Roadster, a CRX, a Skyline. Right, we are going for the third five-minute race. Let's do this. I'm going to go this camera angle and see how quick we can go. I have a feeling we'll get five laps in for this one because the laps are like a minute 20 each. So that'll be enough for us to get... Shit, I can't do maths. 
Actually, we might only get four in then. Get out of the way! Come on! Thank you. Oh, that is a skyline though, and that is a very nice R30 in front. Look at that. Look at that car. That is stunning. That is such a nice looking car. Here we go. Perfect. Right, we're coming up to the two minute mark so far. There we go, nice. And slowing down. Perfect. Right. 7.4 seconds ahead, though. That is very good. Oh! Getting those drifts in. That is style on a mass scale. Perfect. Let's do this. I'm obviously aiming every single lap to get slightly faster. Because that's what we should always do. Is get slightly faster each time. That was the perfect braking spot. This car has surprisingly powerful brakes, though. Let's see that drift again. That was awesome. Okay, so we are only going to be able to squeeze in four laps. Here we go, lap number four. Oh, we've hit the wall there. That's not great. Okay, we messed that, messed that corner up. Completely messed that up. There was no chance we were making that corner like that.
Here we go. On to the final straight. And across the line in style. Spin around. Let's have a look. Uh, so, yeah, we did first. Everyone managed to get four laps. Uh, but obviously, we were the quickest to do those four laps. 8,000 credits. Very nice. And next up, I think, is the go-karting. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. I do like go-karting. I do like the go-karting in this game. In Gran Turismo. It is very fun. Uh, one make races. Oh, cool. Okay, so we'll come to those uh, later on. But Sunday Kart Junior Races is first up. So we are going to be taking... Wow, we're definitely not taking a Camaro. Here we go. Racing Kart. They're all Junior Racing Karts, so... Let's just go. And we're on to the GT Arena for this first one. Oh, so that's why the logo looks like that, because the track's like that. I'm guessing anyways. Okay, so we're all in racing car Yeah, the track is shaped like that. That's fair enough. That kind of makes sense. Right, let's start then. Oh, look at that. Racing car time. Go, go, go. Nice go. Right, we've got one more go card to overtake. These cards are pretty slow. Though to be fair, they are called junior cards, so it makes sense. I want to try and at least get first. We are gaining very slowly, but we won't get first. We'll get second on this. Well, actually, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Oh, close. Close, but no cigar. Oh, and it's crashed again. It's crashed again. Right, so I went back and redone the race, and we got ourselves three stars for that. Uh, so we are now moving on to the Autumn Ring Mini for two stars. Uh, let's just go. I want to see if I can learn how to play this on actual guitar. Like, that would be pretty sick to just go like... <laughs> that would be pretty awesome. Here we go, though. 1.59 miles for this track. But in a go-kart, that feels much longer. you got a cart in my blind spot over there. That was a very good corner there. Nice. Up into first place already. This would be a very weird experience because this is like a full width track. 
And like, you're driving a go-kart. This doesn't seem right. There we go. Oh, I got go-karts coming up my ass. Very good corner there. You don't actually lose much speed with these go-karts in the corners. Very good. I'm trying to get below 50 seconds for this lap. It would be good to get below 50. Yeah, we're not going to get that. Maybe. 10 seconds. 6, 5, 4, 3. Oh, we got it. Nice. Below 50. Awesome. Let's see our results as well. 1.9 seconds ahead and then third place was 2.5. So we weren't a huge amount faster. But then when you think about it, that's a short race. Normally go-kart races would be a little bit longer than that. But first place, three stars. Very nice. On to the next race then, please. Uh, we're going to see what track it is. And I think it might be the space area one. Kart space. Cart space, yeah. I have seen this track from, um, I think it was in Gran Turismo 5 as well. Um, but it is, it's a pretty cool track. Cart space. Oh my gosh, that looks even better. Wow. Let's go then. Look at all the lights. That is just cool. Right, we've got three laps of cart space. Go, go, go. Awesome. I love that there's like little elevation changes as well. That's pretty cool. Very nice. Coming around the corner to the start finish line for lap number two. Whoa, okay. Here we go, perfect. Coming around the bank turn again. Nice. Coming on to the final lap now. Oh, bit of a drift there. Nice. Slow down, come on. Perfect. Brembo. Brembo breaks. And across the line, finish. 31.317. That is a very good time. 3.7 seconds ahead. Wow. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to keep up to date on the Mechanic CG channel, then be sure to check out the description for our social links. We've got Twitter, Discord, and Instagram if you want to go check all of those out. Uh, if you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button. Or you can go and grab yourself some merch. Either would mean the world to me. But thank you guys so much for watching. Peace. Run for your fucking life. <laughs>